Okay, Jibo, this is a quick video for you here. Uh, just to show you how to log into your website, the back end, and change some things. If you need a few things changed here and there, just so you can do it on your own, it's, it's really, really simple. So we're going to go to, I'm going to send you the, the links you need, but it's TO Music Lessons dash WP Admin, and it will redirect you to this login place here. I have your username and password saved here on my computer, but I'm just going to log in. And again, I'll send you this. This is the back end of the website. All we really care about for you is, you know, editing different pages. And actually, I do want to edit um, the home page for a second there. So we're going to go. To Find the page, you're going to click edit. Let me show you that again because I did that too quickly. So we're going to go pages. Here are all the pages. If you scroll over them, there's edit, quick edit, trash, view, clone, edit with Elementor. So we're going to go to the home page, we're going to click edit. The first thing you asked me to change was this, to add guitar here, or to add piano. So piano. Okay, piano and bass, with all the music is this, play a PJ. Okay. Oh. Kids of all ages. So I'm going to just edit that. This is your description that's shown in Google. Don't really need to worry about that too much. Anytime we make a change, we're going to hit update. But now I'm going to show you how to edit the actual page content. So this is just the SEO content. Not Nothing too much to worry about. We're going to click Edit with Elementor, that big button, and that's going to take us to the to the page editor, uh, with his, which is what the uh, site is built on. Okay, so basically. If we need to add anything more, we can add a new button, we can add a new video, we can add a new image, we can add a heading, columns, text. It's really easy. You just kind of scroll, you drag and drop, and then you add different things. But we don't really need to, to add much. But if you want to like edit different things, you just click on the area you want to edit, and you edit it here in this box. You can scroll it. We can scroll it out so it's bigger. So you can edit there, and then you just have to click update every time you make a change, and that will update the page. So you know, say if you wanted to, you know, edit this music lessons offered. So we just that's where it is, uh, you know. And if we had uh, a link that we wanted to link out to, you can add the link there. And, and I'm going to change this to. Toronto music lessons offered. Increase the SEO capacity there. So here I've added different things. Again, if you need, here I added your rates. So lesson rates started to 10 monthly. Um, so I just added it there. If you need to change anything there, again, if you need to add any more thing, you just go into here, you scroll down, you click it, and you just type it in here and click update. So we're going to update it. And that's it. Then you're going to click here. You're going to click on settings, I believe. No, we're going to click on here. Exit to dashboard. And then you go to all pages again if you need to edit the next, next page. You can do that. 
let's do your, you know, your electric bass and upright bass lessons. Okay, then we're just going to go edit. All right, there's the title description. We're going to edit with Elementor. This is the main heading. It's good. We want the keywords in there, especially because that is an H1 tag. That should be an H1 tag, but it's an H2 tag. I'm going to change it to an H1 tag. Uh, this, yeah, this one's going to be an H1 tag. But same thing here. You need to add any more content or whatnot. Just go in, click on it, curriculums, I think it's just a few different base curriculum. Update it. And that's it. Okay, we're going to exit the dashboard. I want to make sure the other pages are like that. It's an H1 tag. Something I didn't catch before. So we're going to edit guitar, edit piano, and we're going to edit ukulele. Oh, with Elementor. So I just basically opened those new tabs. You don't need to see me do this. I can finish it myself. But this is basically, you know, all you need to do is pages and then edit. And so you can add different things to those pages here. Edit with Elementor, or click update, then you're done. You don't have to worry about any of this other stuff here. That's for me. If you have any questions, let me know.